Hello everyone. Today I'd like to talk to you about a the release of exploit code that puts Oracle database users at risk of attack. And the uh, TNS poison vulnerability that was discovered, or at least according to the security researcher who discovered it, uh, Jacques Cien Corret, uh, he called it the Oracle TNS poison vulnerability. Now what this vulnerability uh, uh, does, or whoever exploits this vulnerability, are able to do is to essentially uh, put a ma uh, to conduct a man in the middle attack, so to speak, uh, with the Oracle database server and the legitimate clients. Now, what struck me was that Oracle has declined to patch a critical vulnerability in its flagship product. Essentially, this Oracle TNS poison vulnerability. And according to Coret, this is a zero day vulnerability with no patch. So it doesn't make any sense to me why Oracle wouldn't patch this, at least until now. According to this article by in the by by the um, by by Joxy and Coret. And it says patch your database ASAP with Oracle Critical Patch Update, April 2012. So, okay, this vulnerability was reported in um, 2008. So it really took them four years to, to take care of this problem. Well, according to Oracle, it says that they, they wouldn't patch this uh, because it would cause they were concerned that it would cause regressions in the code base. So, okay, in most cases, I know other software companies, they usually patch reported vulnerabilities pretty quickly, like within a 30-day period. Like Microsoft, for example, has its patch Tuesday, um, or, or Adobe patches its stuff. But for Oracle to wait four years, kind of makes me think, okay, why would they wait four years? So it's a, it's a real puzzling thing. I mean, you know, if it was most companies out there would try to fix these things pretty quickly because for obvious reasons, like it, the, the product would be less trusted if it wasn't. Uh, it wasn't patched, you know. I mean, hackers could break this thing, you know, it would be like Swiss cheese. So, anyway, let me know your concerns, your thoughts, your opinions on this. And I will be posting the uh, links to this article and to the uh, article on secless.org uh, below this video. So please have a look through them and uh, let me know your thoughts. And uh, look forward to your thoughts, comments, and so on. Thank you very much.